say to everybody was, I'm a single mom of four, I could do anything. And I gotta tell you that, you know, putting all this together and adding the campaign onto it, that's uh, that's probably my limit of what I can handle. Now, how do you keep up track with all these chicken dinner events that you have to go to as a candidate? And Palm Coast, to Crescent City, to Pearson, to Deland, to all Port Orange. I mean, it's gonna be a pretty big uh, circle there for you to travel. It is, it is. And especially, I think, this last 30 days is gonna be particularly crazy. But I just try to make it to as many things as I can. My goal is to meet as many people as I can and let them um, know me because I think that this race is about who we really are as people, not what you see on paper. Now, I, I know that the, um, the, the, the judiciary is starting to get gray real fast and a lot of retirements and younger people are coming in and there's more female judges on the bench now. Um, how, what, how important do you think it is being a mom, being a cop, having that uh, excellent educational background that you have in terms of what you can apply on the bench? Um, I, I think all of that is very important. I think that the, um, the legal experience and education is important, but also the life experience and education is equally important too. Um, I've, I've been through a lot in my, my 44 years, 44 years tomorrow. And um, thank you. And I, I think that that's important in terms of what I bring to the table. Um, I, like I said, I've been a single mom for a long time. Um, I've made good decisions with my four children. And those are all the things that enable me to, for example, serve as a better family law judge because I know how things should work. Now, I just want to say when I was uh, covering the uh, George Zimmerman trial in Sanford, <coughs> I met, bless you, Sorry. I met Judge Alex, I think is his name. Um, there's Judge Wapner, there's uh, Judge Judy. Uh -huh. Do you have a favorite judge on TV or do you consider these people to be like, do you get made fun of or you're going to be a judge? I've, I've never had that question. Um, we, ha we have our own local Judge Judy, by the way, too. Really? Um, Judy Davidson, Judge Davidson, who's a county court judge, and they call her Judge Judy. That's sometimes. right. She ran and uh, I think she was unopposed. Uh, yeah, she was. Yeah. She was. Um, I don't, I don't have a favorite celebrity judge. Honestly, I don't watch a lot of TV. That's probably not surprising given everything else I'm doing, but um, I like the real life judges. I liked Judge Perry out of Orlando. I thought he was great. Had that was the uh, Casey Anthony judge? Yeah, he had control of the courtroom. Um, he was firm, he was decisive, and um, I, I thought he did a great job. You remember Judge Ito? Yes. OJ? Yes. Uh, I guess you wouldn't want to be in that kind of scenario, right? Um, I'll do whatever is thrown on me. I mean, I'm, I'm the kind of person that's up for any challenge, um, ready to do whatever is asked of me. Uh, any uh, audience questions for uh, Judge Candidate, Judge uh, Weston here, Judge Candidate Weston? Uh, you can't ask her about what, what party affiliation she's in, then allow that, you get, you'd have to look it up. Um, they, you can't really talk about her opponents. Um, any other questions, or are we all set? The judge Candidate's kind of get. Yeah. Quick and easy. Yeah. Oh, one question. Okay. Yeah. Please stand up and uh, give us your name in your home community. Jim Brooks, Houston, Beach.